Welcome back to Ground Zero, everyone. We've got two stories lined up for you that are sure to warm the cockles of your heart. In the first story, a group of primary school pupils attended to a cat that injured itself after falling from a great height. According to Stomper Amanda, an injured cat was found lying on the ground, weak and purring softly. The Stomper called the SPCA and while waiting for them to arrive, the students took care of the cat. They cleaned the cat's bleeding nose and went around residents' houses asking for some cat food for the cat. Amanda says this made her feel very proud of them. Praise poured in for the students. K Post Stomper 95 said, Good students. Singapore should have more people like this, while Julie Biggins said, Thumbs up for this, these kids with a heart. Other netizens, however, were concerned that the SPCA had been alerted and wondered if the cat would be put to sleep. Well, here's hoping the cat turned out alright and is recovering nicely now. In this next clip, a kind stomper lent a helping hand to an injured cyclist. Stomper Casey says this uncle was left bleeding after a lorry hit his bicycle. The stomper helped to stop his bleeding and called for an ambulance. The stomper says he saw the uncle bleeding from the head and nose when he arrived on the scene. The uncle's knee was also injured. The stomper gave the uncle tissue paper to stop the bleeding and called for an ambulance and the police. The stomper also waited with the uncle until the police and ambulance arrived at around 8.35am. The stomper commented, Anyone know this uncle? After the accident, how is he doing? Is he at the hospital or at home? I am a concerned passerby and I hope he is fine. We hope the uncle is doing fine too and kudos to Stompers Casey and the students for their kind-hearted deeds. In the next clip, we round things off with a strange sighting at Lorong Asu, so stay tuned.